Welcome back to West 11 Lane. Today, I'm excited to take you on a trip to Oceanside and on a full tour of my most recent project, our brand new beach house. At just under 600 square feet, this home is unique in that it actually shares a lot with another home, but each home is separately fenced off from the other, so it allowed us to turn the front home into a vacation rental. The challenge? I had just about seven weeks to transform this home and today I am so excited to show you exactly how it turned out. Are you ready to take the tour? Let's go. Do you not love this space? I have to say that for this to have come together in under two months, I think is quite the miracle and I'm completely obsessed. So the theme of the home in itself is laid back luxury and I utilize a natural color palette calling upon greens and blues, which are generally very soothing. And I wanted to create a space for folks to come get away from all the stress in their lives and just be able to put their feet up, breathe a sigh of relief and really have a wonderful time here. So when it comes to designing an entryway, I always make it such a priority because it is the first impression of the space and also the last. So here again, I wanna consider different aspects such as lighting for convenience and comfort. I wanna make sure that we have plenty of storage space and just little convenience pieces like these hanging wall hooks. You know, when you're coming in from the beach, you wanna just quickly hang your towel. Absolutely love this wall mirror. I feel like if you're gonna go with a mirror, go big or go home, I think it can only enhance your space. And I was very intentional about putting it here, not only for people to be able to look at themselves before they leave the house, but also because there are a lot of windows on the opposite side of the home. So I wanted the sunlight to actually ricochet off of this wall and throw it back into the room. In addition to that, this piece is really awesome because it has plenty of storage for things like all of your beach towels, beach blankets here, and you have sand toys, bocce ball, other things that you might need for outside, plastic wine glasses, and sanitizer, of course. So I'm super pleased with how this turned out, and I think it's gonna be the perfect way to welcome our guests. One of my absolute favorite pieces in this home is this beautiful hanging chair by Kubu and I'm actually partnered with them and I absolutely love the natural wood design. It's just so much fun and creates an experience. I can just imagine people sitting here in the morning with their coffee, enjoying the beautiful sunshine here in Oceanside and just being able to relax and have a new experience that perhaps they wouldn't have in their own homes. Okay, so speaking of specialty pieces that I am so happy that I found. So uh, originally I was looking for a root console table. If you don't know what that is, do a quick Google search. It is so beautiful and I was completely had my heart set on it. Um, but I called Malibu Design Center and they didn't have any idea when they would be back in stock. So I was kind of in a bit of a predicament. Lo and behold, my son and I were in Home Goods down in San Diego. We saw a few people looking at this piece, putting their hands on it. I feel like once people start to interact with a piece, you know it's good. Let me tell you, 
the amount of attention this piece had gotten between the time that I purchased it and the next day that when I picked it up was unbelievable. And I almost actually didn't pick it up because I wasn't sure that it would fit in the space because originally we had a curtain rod set up here and it was a little bit too tight. The lady that worked there said, trust me with the number of people who have stopped to ask about this piece, you will be sorry if you leave it. And so I said, you know what? Let's just put it in the car. I figured it out, took the car seat out of the car to manage and drove it all the way up here to Oceanside. And I finished it off with another lamp here. This is actually from my store. I don't think I mentioned that before. All of the lighting in this home is from my store, shopwest11lane.com. I'm completely obsessed. It is so beautiful with the texture and the two-tone with the gray. I just love it. And that's that. love a story about a game time decision, this sofa would be it. So if you guys are following me on Instagram, you know that everything that could have gone wrong with this house along the way pretty much did. And this was not the original sofa that I had selected, to be honest. The original piece that I selected is still stuck in Miami. We're not exactly sure why, but I ended up having to cancel it because we were down to the wire with less than a week before our guests arrived and we could not not have a sofa. So here again, the heroes of this project are definitely all of our space and I am partnered with them as well. I do have a code that I will add down at the bottom or if you're interested, you can get $100 off and it is a rental company so you can rent your furniture and see if you like it, test it out. And then um, if you decide that you wanna keep it, then they'll just take whatever you've spent and apply it to the total cost of the piece. So I think it's really a great way to, like I said, test things out, switch up your decor. It's very eco-friendly because it gives pieces new life so I'm such a fan and I love that I was able to incorporate the custom pillowcases that I had already selected. The aspect that I love about this piece is that it has a long continuous cushion and not only does it look very neat in an open concept space, but it also allows for guests to pile on as many people as they want. I have to mention this coffee table because I love a good concrete moment. I put it in all of my designs to be honest and I think this is just such a good heavy piece that can be used and used and used. It's not you know, anything people are gonna worry about ruining or breaking. And it's just a great place to go ahead and play games and relax with the book. I'm on my way now. What I love about this table is that it has an elegant pedestal base and additionally it did come with this leaf which allows you to either enjoy it as a smaller table where you have much more room to walk around or if you would like to expand your dining space you can add the leaf in and have plenty of room to spread out. I'm on my way now. designing behind this banquette, I decided on multiple frames, being that every time I go to LA or New York City, I find that all the coolest restaurants have all the best photos on the wall. So I wanted to recreate that moment and really tell a story of being here by the beach in Oceanside. When it comes to having a kitchen on vacation, I definitely feel like it's an important piece, especially when you're a family. We definitely find that it's a lot easier to have meals here at home rather than going out for every single meal. With this particular kitchen, it is allowing for just enough space to get everything done that you need. And so being that we had limited storage, I was very careful to select only the necessary items that folks would need to get through a long weekend or even just a short-term stay. So 
So again, this is a two bedroom, one bath, and this is a tiny bathroom, but it's just enough space. I absolutely love this beautiful glass door. This was here from the previous owner. And the shower step is very low to the ground, which is great for safety. Again, bringing in beautiful soft towels from Parachute, a little bit of rattan on the walls, and we are good to go. I'm on my way now. primary bedroom. So I love the bedrooms here. They're so adorable and quaint and I really wanted to make these spaces cozy and you know with a fixed budget I had to really make the decisions of where I wanted to spend the majority of my money. Really where I tended to splurge was with the bedding and also the towels and this is Percale from Parachute Home. You may be familiar with them. They have a few locations, a couple in LA. I can't. You just have to try it out honestly. You just take my word for it. It's unbelievable. And then of course we have this all set up for our guests because they are going to be here in the morning. In this corner I added a full length mirror not only to expand the feel of the space but also obviously for function if you know, folks are going out for date night or you know just out having a good time. It's a great way to check out your outfit, a little bit of greenery of course. And this artwork is actually from my store as well. It just reminds me actually of being on Oahu with my husband because we used to walk through the surf shops. He's an avid surfer and it's just rows and rows of surfboards so it feels very vacation-y very much at the beach and surf is big here anyway so i thought it was perfect this is the second bedroom we had went through plenty of iterations uh first we were having bunk beds then we were having wooden beds and so many things were back ordered and delayed and so we ended up with these metal beds i think it's a great choice it's very kind of beach cottagey this is the dresser that I have used on three projects at this point. I have a couple in my home as well, and honestly, I feel like it is the white t-shirt of furniture because you can dress this up or down by just simply changing out the hardware or the accessories on top, and I love it. It definitely is very good quality for the price point because around 300, so very, very reasonable, and it's lasted for us for years, so I think that's a great thing. This lamp is also from my shop. Again, shopwest11lane.com. All the lighting here I'm completely in love with, which is why it's in my store. This wall, we have finished off with, again, a mirror. As soon as I saw this mirror, by the way, I almost fell on the floor because it has the cane detail. This woven detail matches the macrame that's in the hallway, and it just flows so well and the rattan and I just thought you know what this mirror was made for me and I have to have it so again it was just a moment where I dropped everything ran to the front of the store with a piece and made sure that they held it aside for me this was a TJ Maxx find you guys under $70 over here again talk about TJ Maxx I found these shelves on clearance for $10 each and I was carrying them around literally throughout the entire project until four days ago when Peter the installer came and hung them here because I finally had just found this mirror and it all came together. I love this surf book and just a little bit of accessories from local shops here in the area. I love to support other small business owners. So yeah, I think it's adorable and I just love it. So that's all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this tour. We are so excited to welcome our very first guest tomorrow afternoon. And in the meantime, if you love this video, I'd really appreciate it if you could hit that like button and the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you know just as soon as a new video drops. As always, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.